Thank you very much. Thank you all for being here. It's a real pleasure for me uh, to be here. It's a privilege for several reasons. One, it's a privilege to be playing here at the Kennedy Center Millennium Stage, one of the great performing arts venues in the world. It's also a privilege for me to be invited to be part of the Basically Your series for the DC Jazz Festival. And uh, yeah. But most, mostly it's uh, a privilege for me to be sharing the stage with these two splendid musicians. Uh, give a round of applause for Emmett Cohen on the piano. And Billy Hart on the drums. These gentlemen are very, very busy. They're traveling the world all the time. And for me to be able to have them come to this gig is a really uh, big deal for me. And uh, Emmett is currently the pianist with the Christian McBride Band. Uh, and yes, and Billy Hart is—he's uh, part of jazz history. He's played with everybody, um, and I can't think of a jazz musician alive who's a more heavyweight player than Billy Hart. So thank you. I would. That first tune was a Thad Jones tune entitled Three and One. We're going to continue with a tune um, written by Hector Villalobos. Villalobos was a uh, Brazilian composer uh, born in 1897. I think he died in 1959. He wrote a series of pieces uh, called the Bacchianos Brasileiros. And these are pieces for which he um, married some of the characteristics of J.S. Bach's music with his own sense of Brazilianness, and uh, he wrote nine suites. Uh, they have multi-movement suites. This is from the second suite, and the uh, it's the last movement entitled Takata, uh, but to me it sounds more like a uh, samba. This is called Little Train. Thank you. 
This next piece is by uh, one, of, one of Washington's favorite sons, Duke Ellington. This is a beautiful tune called All Too Soon.
Thank you. That was, of course, uh, the great Rogers and Hart tune, uh, My Funny Valentine. This next tune is a tune written by Stephen Sondheim. And um, I did a couple of albums a few years ago devoted to the music of Stephen Sondheim, and I discovered why it isn't done very much. Uh, they're very difficult to try to adapt to jazz. But once in a while, I come across a tune that really works because it's very symmetrical in the way that jazz musicians like to improvise. And this is one such tune. It's called The Best Thing That Has Ever Happened. It's from a show of his called Roadshow.
here's a tune by a Cuban composer by the name of Osvaldo Fares. This is called, well, the English translation is called Without You.
Thank you very much. We have time for one more tune. Thank you all for coming. It really has been a joy for me uh, playing for you and playing with these guys. It's really been great. Again, Emmett Cohen on the piano. And Billy Hart on the drums. Here's a Charlie Parker tune, a blues. Uh, strike that, we're gonna do um, some monk rhythm changes.
Thank you. We have CDs in the back. Thanks for coming.